Hi guys, Penny Rose Journals, how you doing? Okay, here we are with our little bits of brown paper that have been on the desk for a few days. Um, these were the off cuts of the little albums that we did the other day. And they've just been sitting here wanting to have something done with them. Um, so I can get rid of them. <laughs> Normally I would just throw them in my scrap drawer, but because they're here um, and they're a decent size to make something with, I thought, let's make something with them. Now, aside from covering up the logo, not sure what I want to do with these. So it's just going to be, again, a case of following my nose and see what happens. So, um, yeah, come along for the ride. <laughs> There's just a couple of small little sections here that are not properly stuck down. Um, these are the seams of the paper bag and the glue never quite seems to reach the edges. So I am just gonna go along and glue all of those down so that they don't catch on anything um, because that would annoy me. <laughs> Okay, clearly at this point a decision has been made. Um, <laughs> I've decided to make these two into little um, envelopes. So I thought they would make cute little brown paper envelopes. So I am just going to ink those up a little bit, stick them together. Um, yeah, I'll ink them further as I go, but for now I just want to ink that sort of section that sort of is difficult to ink once you've glued it together. And uh, amazing, I know I remembered. <laughs> That's very rare. <laughs> so yes, we'll glue those together and um, eventually we'll decorate them up a little bit as well to look a bit more like you know, envelopes, I guess. <laughs>
these are just images of stamps out of a uh, stamp catalogue. I'm just going to cut them apart and use them for postage stamps on my little envelopes because why not? Okay, I've got this little strip of manila folder. I'm just going to make up some cute little cards just to pop in these envelopes and then the whole thing is nicely finished and I can just pop it in my ephemera drawer. So, <laughs> yep, yeah, that's the next thing. Use up these little scraps of manila folder that are lying on the desk as well. Right, moving on to these next couple. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with these. I'll probably make little um, folders. So, yeah, bear with me while I work that one out.
Okay, well there we go. Um, now a little bit of stamping and maybe a couple of labels or something and we're completed. Um, that's four paper bag bottoms completely used. How fantastic is that? And we have some cute ephemera as well. So <laughs> anyway, we'll get on with decorating these and see what it is we end up with exactly. These are my little labels that I harvest out of textbooks. So um, yeah, I'm just gonna pop a one of these on the front of each one. And um, yeah, I think it makes it look quite cute. Okay, a quick tidy up of my stamps. Um, I'm using a lot of stamps lately, so they do build up on my desk pretty quickly. Um, they need to be put away. I uh, will do that a bit later. But in any case, here we have it. This is what we have managed to create today. And I think they are pretty special, considering they're made out of the off cuts and discards of the bottom of brown paper bags. So yeah. <laughs> I hope you guys like them. Um, thanks so much for being here and bearing with me while I worked out what I was doing. <laughs> um, yeah, just something else you can do with scraps. So, all right, guys, I hope you have a wonderful day. It's been fantastic having you here, as it always is, and I will see you again tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.